is I've scanned 30 or 40,000 people who have ADD of one type or another. It's not one thing. Early on, I'm like, oh, it's seven different things. The seven types. Type one is the classic. It's what most people think of ADHD. Short attention span, distractibility, disorganization, impulsivity, and hyperactivity. They can't sit still. That's type one, classic. Type two is inattentive ADD. Short attention span, distractibility, disorganized, procrastinate, but they're not impulsive. They're not hyperactive. In fact, they can be a little bit hypoactive. The third one is overfocused ADD, where the problem is not so much you can't concentrate, it's you can't shift your attention. And if you can't shift your attention, you cannot pay attention. And they tend to be argumentative, oppositional, worry. If things don't go their way, they get upset. And on the surface, they appear selfish. They're really not selfish. They're just not flexible. Type four is called limbic ADD. It's where their emotional brain is too busy. And it's sort of like ADD plus mild depression. And the glass is always half empty for them. Type five, which I think is such an interesting one, is temporal lobe ADD. They have problems in one or both of their temporal lobes, often goes with learning problems, but mood instability, irritability, temper problems. One of my first great cases was Chris, and this time he took a pencil and put it in the neck of one of his classmates. Stimulants made him hallucinate, uh, all the other medicines, and I'm like, I'm scanning you. And he had left temporal lobe problems goes with violence. I put him on an anti-convulsant, an anti-seizure medicine, became the sweetest kid. And then the ring of fire, that's one I may be most known for. The problem is not low activity, it's too much activity. Please don't give them a stimulant because they can become violent, aggressive. I actually use a supplement to calm things down in their brain, very effective. And then the last one's anxious. ADD, where they're really anxious. And so they tend to be early to things, but disorganized, distracted, and so on. So knowing the type, yes. and that's why Ritalin has a bad reputation. 